Honestly, you'd probably be fine with the 40. And then you're just like, no, I'll get a 46. Good morning. Look at this. That's Upper Barren. <clears throat> so yeah, it's uh, it's like quarter after six, or here like two and a half. Well, we're like one and a half miles in today. We got this little climb here, and then. Uh, a bunch of a descent <clears throat> and then another pretty decent climb after that but then after that I think it's pretty much it for the climbing there's a little bit of up and down but nothing really significant so but yeah this area is just incredible just unbelievable Yeah, so it's day three, so definitely starting to feel a little more broken in. Um, it's been really hot though. So it's nice to get an earlier start. It's not really necessarily cool right now, but it's a lot nicer than doing these climbs in the sun right in the middle of the day. So yeah, we're planning on like about 13 miles, I think, today to Hidden Lake, so we'll see how that goes, but I think it'll be a really good day and check in again. In the morning.
<laughs> so we ended up doing what did we say 21 miles today yeah that was a long day but um we just made it to elk lake here so i think we have um probably what do i have like 11 miles i guess yeah, probably 11 miles to do tomorrow, so. But, uh, but yeah, so we went up, we left Barren Lake. Um, then we went up and over um, whatever pass that was. I can't remember what it was called. Um, and then down to the out for Redfish, uh, Redfish Lake. And then we climbed up to uh, Kramer Lakes. And then we climbed up over... Um, that pass right beside Mount Kramer and then down so yeah we did we did a pretty big loop there today but um, but yeah we're just not gonna have enough time to do that bottom section of the loop so we'll have to come back and do that but but yeah I think it's still gonna end up being probably about 90 kilometers by the time we're done so 55 ish miles but but yeah the day was beautiful it was just long day Jen and my feet are pretty wrecked. Judd's got tons of blitz blisters. She's got Nico tape and tons of band-aids happening. Views. She's just been popping blisters like crazy so hopefully tomorrow they heal up a little bit but yeah we only got like a 10 or 11 miles out here so it's not that bad but but uh yeah should be a good night and we'll check in in the morning. <laughs>